I didn't see you there. I... How long have you been standing there? Please wait, please wait. No, I'll go. She's already heard enough from you. All right, counselor. When you say I take you home. Liza just cannot keep her hands off other people's men. Oh, I feel so bad for Colby. Doing that to your own kid is just sick. Liza made a mistake. You're defending her? No, but I've known both of them for a long time. Liza loves her daughter more than anything. That's why she took her away from Adam all those years ago. All right, all right, wait a second. If you're about to compare yourself to Liza... We'll both call party foul. No, no, I'm not saying I'm that messed up, but... Jay knows. I love him. Okay, he knows. Yeah. She's about to leave, isn't she? Yeah, yeah, I think so. Uh-huh. <laughs> that obvious? We've both been there. True. Go. See AJ. But don't let JR think he's responsible for getting you there. <laughs> Not a chance. Good girl. <laughs> Bye. I am so glad you came with us tonight. Me too. It feels good to just be out of the house, connecting with people again, especially my sister. Mm -hmm. However, I uh, do have some kids to go home to as well, so I gotta go. Okay, okay, but but we're doing this again soon. Oh, yes, for sure. All right. Thank you. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Bye. Give me some. Bye. Using AJ to get Marissa back at the mansion? Yes, I am. A suite of rooms right down the hall from her son. How horrible can I be? Just, uh, pretty horrible, I remember right. Just don't hurt Marissa again. I never would. Sure. Speech Liza made. Is Colby okay? I tried to talk to her, but she can't deal. I'll try again when she calms down. <sighs> Where the hell is this guy? Who? I'm interviewing someone to take over Annie's old job. He's half an hour late. You're hiring? I wanted to. Looks like I got stood up. Yeah, me too. Jake was supposed to meet me for dinner. I'm sorry. Is there anything I can do? Actually, yes. You can hire me. The Chandler? Well, oh, I don't think that's a good fit. Well, Annie was talking about her job all the time. Public relations. Relating to people. I'm really good at that. Yeah, but there's more to it than that. Well, I could I could send up some of the old press releases I did up at Fusion. I am really good at getting people to talk, you know? And positive buzz, that's what Chandler needs right now. I thought you gave all that up to stay at home with Trevor. Well, I did for a while, but we have a part-time nanny now. And I've been volunteering at the Miranda Center, but I am ready for more. Come on, I know I don't have a big resume or some fancy degree, but neither did Babe. And you believed in her, and you encouraged her. Look how far she went. Come on, I am just asking for a chance. All right, no guarantees. I'm willing to give it a shot. Start tomorrow. Thank you. Thank you, JR. You will not be sorry. Just don't be late. Okay. <laughs> Look, if anyone should write the rules on caring for sick children, it should be me. Yeah, well, you're not on the board. Okay, when you are on the board, it'll Look, be different. there is more to healing than what a hospital can provide. Especially when it comes to children. 
You cannot isolate them, Jake. Look at me. They need to be out in the open. I'm not disagreeing with you, okay? You, you can't knock on the kid's door, though, and take her out to play. But you can't tell set. me how to practice medicine, okay? You don't have the right to do that. Actually, I do. Inside these walls, I do. You know what? I go above and beyond for my patients, and I will not stop now. This is not a war zone, Kara. It's not Doctors Without Borders, okay? We have borders in there. You, you, you need to stay inside the borders. Immigration's all over you trying to prove that you're a fraud. Having a job, a real job, that will help you. You need that. Okay. I get it. We're both weirded out that I married your brother, right? So that's what this is about. You're, you're trying to find some kind of clarity by, by drawing the line, by reminding me that you're my boss. It's cool, Jake. I'm gonna go and I'm gonna, I'm gonna apologize. And, and um... Because I need this job, and I will say the words that I am forced to say. Thank you. Thank you for going to bat for me again. But I just, I just need to say this. I will never compromise how I practice medicine for anyone. Just keep going from restaurant to restaurant, huh? <laughs> <laughs> I say Jay. Oh, God, well, when I got here, Opal had already taken him to JR's. It's okay, though. I'm just, I'm gonna see him tomorrow. Do you mind if I join you? Isn't that kind of late? Don't you want to go in your girls? No, oh, they're asleep. Okay, well, then sit down. <laughs> Enjoy yourselves. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. Excuse me. May I please have a big slice of chocolate cake? <gasps> and two forks? Good call. <laughs> Love it. I had fun tonight, Zach. It felt good. I feel like I'm coming back to life again. Why don't you just all just take a really good look, all right? But well, then make sure that you go home and you lock up your boys. Because I'm still here. I'm out here, and I am looking for a good time. Good job, Mom. Almost a million hits. So why are you staying in a hotel? Because every time I go back to my apartment, there's some freak who stopped Colby's video. Some idiot who wants to take a live look at the cougar mom. Oh, oh David, to see that look of disgust in my daughter's eyes. Oh, I know that feeling. I had one daughter who died hating me. The other one, Marissa, wants nothing to do with me. Can you blame her? No, I can't. This is who I am. I'm not going to change. Neither are you, Liza. Our children will either accept us as we are or they won't. There's no controlling that. You know, I wish you would stop comparing me to you because you and I, we are, we're nothing alike. I understand you, Liza. And I think you understand me. So why not make the most of it? You've got quite a wife, though. Yeah, she's something. But you're still gonna tell me it was a mistake to marry her to keep her in the country. No, no I'm not gonna tell you that. I've given a lot of thought to it. How could I not be proud of you? Thanks, Pop. It's a relief to know you're on board. I am. But? I look at you and your brother. I don't think this is going to end well. Hey, hi. Hey. Hi again. Oh, so, your dad told you, I guess, right? He and no. Jake, they got to have to win a position. That's terrific. <laughs> yes, it is. That's it? great. Yeah. So, um, that, no more worries. No. 
I'm sorry I missed dinner. I was crazy at the hospital. I just did. You get my message? Yep. Um, which one is more conservative? Conservative? Why? Because I got a job. It starts tomorrow. Don't worry, they have great daycare. When did, when did all this happen? Well, I ran into JR while I was waiting for you, and he was looking for someone to replace Annie. I said I was interested, so he hired me on the spot. Wow, just... Be happy for me. <laughs> I am so happy for you. Oh, thank you. 